Hmm. What in the world is she doing? It just started firing at me, sir, Uncle. I didn't know. I can't believe this stupid relic is still armed. Can you do something, Dollface? The thing must be at least 50 years old. That's great. Ah! Good work, Leon. You could really dock a hell of a ship in a place like this. They probably had that in mind when they built it. If my guess is right, there should be a repair dock up ahead. We'll be secure here so we can take our time. Rest at last. The catapult has become the norm in space traffic. But the Army has always had its doubts about space compression navigation. There's still a lot of uncertainty and distrust about using Metatron as a variable. So, this base is here for that one in a million chance that the catapult might actually fail? Eh, uh, something like that. Hey, I don't care what it is. It's here. Leon, ship's repairs are in your hands. Help him out, dollface. Oh, okay. These supplies have been sitting here for almost 50 years. That's all right. Army supplies don't expire for a hundred years. <laughs> Hello. Wow. Get everything you think we might need. Don't forget fuel. Okay. And don't forget sufficient rations. All right, I won't. Bye, Dad. And clothes, too, don't forget. And fuel for the ship and fresh towels. I said I would already! I can't accept that! <gasps> While we're sitting around buffing our chairs with our butts, that John Carter is perpetrating evil on Mars! John Carter? Who the heck is that? Oh, James no, Lane and his wretched hell spawn! I am requesting official orders for pursuit immediately! I want authorization! That exceeds our jurisdiction. Your authority is limited to Earth alone. The Martian Army garrison is notified of a potential problem. This is not a potential problem! It is a very real... So long as we remain here, we're out of the Mars surveillance system. But we just can't stay here forever. I suggest you let them... <sighs> Handled by Mars Authority, Southern Main Half Squad! Can Dimos handle itself after being trashed by one LED five years ago? <gasps> I mean, uh, excuse me. Uh, damn it. Five years ago. Dimos Base, huh? No, we have no confirmation on their arrival yet. We've been waiting two days already. They could not have infiltrated Mars without our knowledge, so they haven't arrived. Be prepared to use any means to recover ISIS. Yes. We have strange new information on the location. What is so strange? There's an army satellite called Kudushu well within our range. Kudushu? Never heard of it before. It's been abandoned for over 50 years, but we've recorded active operations there. I see. Our mark? Very likely. Move on it. Hey, Dad. Are you ready for dinner? Uh, Daddy? This is self-defense force number one. It's no use. We're helpless against it. Ah! What's that on the screen? Communication records from the archives. Something called the Dimos Affair. There was an accident during a routine test run on new technology. Many people were killed, and the base sustained considerable damage. Hey, Dad, isn't that... Yes, Noel. This is the accident that your mother was killed in five years ago. Uh... This is it? That's right. They wouldn't conduct an investigation over it. Relations were so bad, still are. Earth figured it was just a Mars accident, and nothing to dirty their hands with. Which was why I quit the army and became a trucker. I knew I had to leave. There was no finding the truth that route, and I had to know what really happened. But the only information I could get was that Mars had undertaken some large-scale construction, a secret operation. The Mars Army was planning something big, but I didn't know what. 
I ran out of answers. There might be some answers here, but this database is in shambles. Mama was at Dimos, wasn't she? Then there has got to be information about what became of her. I've been scanning records for hours now and- Get out of the way! We've got to evacuate! Get Dr. Legs out of here! He said Mama's name! Yeah, but damn it, where is she? I can't find Dr. Legs! The port won't halt! There's an alien LED gone wild! Mama, it's true. Leon, there's got to be more data than this. See what else is on. Uh, 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 uh. <sighs> hey, over here. We have vital signs on this one. Confirm. She's breathing. <gasps> Mama. It's Rachel. Dr. Rachel Stewart Lynx, confirmed. We're transporting her to sick bay. What else? There's got to be more footage. I'm working on it. Hey, what? what's that? These are the recovery lists where the wounded were transported. There she is, Basilia County Army Hospital. And she's alive. They lied to us about her death. I can't believe it. I knew it wasn't true. Rachel. <laughs> Everyone is sure late. I wonder what they're doing. So the Dimos affair began with an AWOL LEV, a Mars-made experiment. Just one LEV did all that damage to the station? Seems unbelievable to me. This was no plain LEV. Leon. Right. I'm bringing it up right now. We've just captured the new Mars weapon! The power and speed is beyond belief! It's Dolores! What? Dolores? Is that possible, Dad? No, it's not. Look at the differences. It's not Dolores, but whoever built her probably built that monster as well. Do you mean Mama built that thing? And now they're lying about her death to keep it secret. Hmm. Either they're lying, or it's possible she's in hiding in order to protect herself. Of course. After all, she sent Dolores to you, right? Yes, but we still don't know the exact reasons for it. I mean, just look at all the trouble she's caused. Is that all I am, Sir huh? Uncle? Trouble? Uh, uh. What are you doing? She's spying on us! I never wanted to be trouble, Sir Uncle. Oh, and I've tried so hard! No, Dollface, listen. Uh, don't take it all out of context, okay? I didn't mean it. Oh, but you did. I've been nothing but trouble. I don't want to be trouble. No, no more. I'm leaving! Hey, Dollface, wait! I didn't mean it! Dolores! I think she's still somewhere inside. I hope. Isn't there surveillance? Can't we do a scan or something to find her? System's wrecked, remember? There's a big malfunction. Well, what happened this time? Dolores knocked out the sensors, so we could get the Ender into the hangar. Uh, I forgot about that. It's okay. She's inside, so we don't have to worry. Well, come on then. Let's form up a search party and find her, shall we? Huh? You find her. Hey, now. I've got to finish resupplying the ship. Yeah, me too. Good luck. Now you two just wait a minute. You made her run off in the first place, Dad. So find her yourself. Now that we know Mama's alive, maybe we can get rid of her. That was probably the only reason Mama sent her to us in the first place. Just so we'd know. What is it with kids nowadays? Why do they always have to fight everything? Someone her size shouldn't be that hard to find. Hmm. Then again, maybe not. Hey! Dollface! 
You know I didn't mean to hurt you. Come out, let's talk about this. For her strength and size, she's got the mind of a five-year-old girl. Well, there's a thought I hadn't considered before. Let's see here. When your child is missing, what to do when your child runs away? Call the police. Well, thanks, that's no help. Hey, dollface! Enough! Let's talk, okay? Huh? What's this? on target. It's just sitting there waiting for us. The surveillance must be offline. This is gonna be so easy. Wait a minute. Uh, we can't rush in half-cocked. You're always too impatient to get into the heat of it, aren't you there, Punchy? Uh, Don't big brother me, big brother. Right, we're on orders. Did you find a good one? Dad found exactly the thing we need. It'll do okay. It's well constructed and will hold just fine on re-entry. Nice, ain't it? Hmm. So, what about Dolores? Uh, I haven't figured it out yet. Well, hurry up. We're almost done with preparations. I'm working on it. Oh! Uh, uh, uh... Wow, what was that? Oh no, I'm feeling that feeling again. It felt like something hit us! The main hatch has been penetrated! Something is breaking into the station! What is it, Leon? What something? I don't know! There wasn't even a warning alarm! How many times do I have to remind you, Dad? Oh, the sensor's right. Okay. <laughs> You two get to the Ender right away. Prep it for takeoff and be ready on standby. I'm going to get Dolores. Careful, Dad! Noel, come on! James Lynx, your fate has finally caught up with you. Something's coming! I'm tracking a large-scale power surge! Coming from where? It's ISIS, isn't it? Uh, look out! <laughs> Sir, are you all right? <sighs> well, I guess that got you out of hiding. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm causing more trouble, aren't I? That was never true. You've never caused me any personal trouble, and I mean that, doll. That's not what you... That was never true. Never mind what I said then, okay? Uncle... What got us? Oh, no! Aim for the cockpit. We want to try and keep the rest intact. Roger already, okay! Sir Uncle... It's happening again! Get a hold of yourself! Try not to lose yourself! Huh? 
Did you hear me? Oh no! Stop! Now just keep talking to me, doll! Anti-fortification battle. Switching over to fuselage mode. Particle cannon, output 50%. Particle cannon! They're going to pulverize the place! No! I don't want it! Stop! Commence offensive. Sir? Uncle? I'm here! Make it stop, sir, Uncle! System unstable. Backup analysis commenced. Stop! You've got to listen to me, doll! I'm fading. I feel like I'm fading. If you let that happen, then there'll be real trouble! System unstable. Uh. Sir, uncle! Sir, uncle! Don't leave me here now! What about the song, doll? Song? That's right, the song you learned from Rachel. Sing! Song from... Uh, uh. Look, I'll help you remember. I'll start singing, and you join in when it comes to you. You think you can do that? Good night, sweet dreams to you. Riding on a ship of clouds. Spread your white wings. Cover me softly. Good night. A flying ship, dreams of journeys past. My memory returns inside the brilliant light. When me look with It's coming out of stall face. Huh? We have no choice. This time, we're finishing it. Sir, Uncle, behind you! Huh? It's okay, you're doing great! I don't feel so well. Damn! That thing's completely unpredictable. I can't make sense of it! What? Out of the way, you idiot! You got it! You on the house! Watch out! No! Anything but my beer stash, you guys! What's with all the beer? Huh? Whoa! Hey, doll, bring that fancy weapon back online. Uh, okay, I'll try. Just give it a shot of minimum power. That would only boil water, so Uncle. That's perfect. Go for it. Okay. What's that? Make a run for it, Leon. Right, we're out of here. Wait, Leon, what about Kitty? What? Are you nuts? We can't just leave her! You're worse than dad, Noelle! I heard that. <gasps> Kitty! You were here the whole time! Great. A barley barricade. Don't worry, big brother! We'll get him! Take that! How are you now, doll? Is this 
sort of what a hangover feels like. Without my beer, it'll be a while before I know that. Thank you, sir, Uncle, for helping me. Well, it was Rachel's song that saved us back there. We have her to thank. And if you want to be grateful, help us find her, okay? Of course. 